As a teacher, you can add blocks to the side of your main learning area. These blocks are on the right. It's possible also to add blocks to the left or to both sides of your course page, depending on your theme. Blocks are elements which add extra information or learning content to your course. Individual users can usually hide blocks by clicking the icon and then by clicking the plus icon to open them up again. And it's important to remember this in case your learners get confused. With some themes, such as this theme, it's also possible to move blocks to the side in a narrow tab. The navigation block here has done that and it's called docking. To dock a block, you click the icon next to the hide icon. If you do this, it's important also to remember that the blocks have been docked so that learners don't get confused as this is an individual setting. To undock them, click and then click the undock icon or if several blocks have been docked, you can go down to the bottom and click undock all. With this Learn Moodle theme and other Moodle 2.5 themes and onwards, they are responsive and that means that when you have a smaller screen size, the blocks are actually moved down to the bottom of the screen. As you can see here, the smaller the screen size, the blocks disappear and reappear down at the bottom. As a teacher, if you want to add extra blocks, you click the Turn Editing On button, top right, or scroll down to Course Administration and click Turn Editing On. This then gives you edit icons for each of the blocks where you can remove them if you don't need them. However, the Administration block and the Navigation block don't have the X Remove icon because they appear everywhere. If you see other blocks without the X Remove icon, this is because the administrator has fixed them throughout the site. Some people call this making blocks sticky. To add a block, you go to the Add Block drop-down and select the block you want. We will take a look at some, some of the blocks in the next videos. Blocks can also be moved simply by dragging them into the place where you wish to move them.